Namibia continues to air its voice on a continued basis. To say, to deny Sahrawi people and Palestinians their basic human rights can never be accepted. We have been in a similar situation and the world has been supporting us. That's why we are today here. So sometimes I say we are therefore the child of international solidarity midwife by the United Nations, but we are sovereign state. Furthermore, we remain committed to a world where our Cuban brothers and sisters can enjoy their economic freedom and sovereignty without interference. Therefore, Namibia continues its call for the removal of the blockade on Cuba. On Ukraine and Russia, Namibia is pained by the horror and devastation that war brings. We know and remember the pain and suffering it inflicts. The dreams are shattered and the hopes destroyed. Our hearts, thoughts and prayers go to the victims, their families and all affected by this serious conflict. As a country that believes in regional, continental, and international harmony, it pains us to witness conflict between neighboring states. There are no winners in a war, only losers. As I always say, where diplomacy fails, conflicts begin. For this reason, I mean, I welcome the ongoing dialogue between Russia and Ukraine to end this conflict.